create a variable using our let keyword called countdown timer. And we're going to make this equal to our set interval built in JavaScript function here. And you guys will see that that sets up a callback function within our set interval JavaScript function. So what we need to do is first, we need to change out the interval here. So this is going to be how often you want to refresh your code here. We want to refresh it every second. So we display down to the seconds, the time remaining until our event. So to do this, we need to go ahead and put 1000, which is going to be how many milliseconds are in a second. And so now our function here is going to run every second. So it's going to refresh our page every second and correctly display the time. And with our set interval function here, we don't need to call this. It is automatically called when our code runs. Tap here for more.